good? It's your boy T-R-E-N-T, -E and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new album reaction. Not just any album. This is by various artists for the soundtrack of Bad Boys for Life. I mean, Bad Boys Ride or Die, a.k.a. Bad Boys 4. And no, I haven't seen the movie, so I'm trying to wait till this weekend pass so y'all can watch it without ruining it for me, and I can go catch it next week. But anywho... I'm about to react to the album. It's going to be different vibes, different songs. But anywho, unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I do not skip the song. I do not pause the song. I listen to the whole song. And at the end, I give my commentary. I grade each song from 0 to 10, 10 being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know that's 5 and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a 6. Now, if it's a good song, depending on how good I think it is and y'all, that's 7 to 10. So make sure y'all stay to the end so y'all can give y'all grade too. And make sure y'all follow me on every social media platform at Look Trent Music. It's spelled the same way as my channel. I'm live on Twitch if y'all got any suggestions. And um, let's see how this go. This is Bad Boys Ride or Die soundtrack. You fucking yeah. going on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction fits. <laughs> this is Duh, Flo Millie. <laughs> That's your girl Flo Millie, duh. You know what I'm saying? She went off that same look, that 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 tempo, that that uh, sample. Y'all know that, but um, that sounds like a fun track, uh, pertaining to the album or the, to the movie. It sounds like something they'll probably play in the car while they, you know what I'm saying, drifting through traffic or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? But um, that's how you rap, like substance wise. Flo Millie be having fun on these tracks. She show her her style. She got style. I put her and Dochi in the same category under um, the Missy Elliott style of rap. You know what I'm saying? They have fun. They got substance. And even though this is a two-minute song, I, I, I keep on saying, like, songs need to be three minutes to be a perfect song. But I, I kind of enjoyed it, you know what I mean? And I want Bia to take lessons from girls like Dochi and uh, Flo Millie because they actually, you know what I'm saying? She gave two verses. She made it. She stretched the song out as much as she could. It's it's two minutes. I'm still going to downgrade the um my grade. But 
it's a good song. I'm going to give this one a 7.5. It's a good song, but it needed a little bit more. It's just a regular fun track. I don't know how it's going to be in the movie, but I can't wait to see it. I can't wait to hear what part they going to um, play these songs. And it's the crazy part. Me reacting to these songs, when I watch the movie, I'm going to be able to identify the songs. You know what I mean? But, um, yeah, my grade is a um, 7.5. I don't think Flo Millie. Flo Millie probably did make the top 10 of that um, Billboard top 10 female rappers. I forget where she fall, but... If it was my list, I'm definitely putting her in my personal top 10, along with, you know what I'm saying, you know, H Time Zone, Meg, Lotto, um, Doja Cat, Rhapsody, Cardi B. I fuck with JT. She deserved to be in that top 10. That's So that's six right there. And um, personally, I would put Carla Ray in there. Um, them seven will be on my personal list. But I have reacted to um, Flo Millie album that she put out earlier this year. So if y'all some Flo Millie fans, y'all want to see how I reacted to her latest album, make sure y'all subscribe and check that out. But for right now, leave y'all grade. My grade is a 7.5. We halfway through the album. It, most of the songs is good. So there's going to be probably a solid soundtrack. Uh, we got a couple more to go to, so if y'all rocking out with me, click the next video. If not, ah.